Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So I tried braiding my hair for the very first time in my 80 years natural hair journey and this is what came out of it. I have been consistent for the past two, the past two weeks and this is how great I did the first time trying on my hair. So with that being said, guys, if it's something that you're interested in, keep on watching the video and also videos on everything related to this video will be linked in the description box, guys. So with that being said, let's dive right into the video and oh, I will upload it on my face feel soon enough, okay? Alright, let's jump right into the video now. So I'm going to be using Brazilian wool and I'll be using my leave-in Ayurvedic conditioner. It's in the description box and my hair growth oil is also in the description box. I'm going to be coating my hair with castor oil and my vitamin E. If you are like me that you just cannot braid your hair guys. Yes. Cornrows, no cornrows, not even a flat twist. All that you can do is just some twist and some three strand braid. Don't worry, you are welcome. I am proud of you guys. So I cannot just braid my hair. I have been consistent for two weeks before I was able to do this one twist, guys. It was, I went through hell and back, like seriously. I, I'm gonna upload a video on my, the first time I tried doing it. I feel like that was a feel, but for the sake of someone out there who just wants to braid their hair, but you know, fun of finding inspiration, if I was able to do this today, then I, you should know that you can too. So I will upload on my first feel so that you guys can watch. So I have already um, prepped my hair. I have already uploaded a video on that and it's also in the description box. So guys, you can feel free to check it out. So I prepped my hair um, two weeks ago and ever since then I've been trying and failing, trying and failing and this is the best um, um tutorial or the best way that i can actually do it so i felt like you know what i'm gonna stick with this for a few weeks and then see now i wanted to do not less twist so braid but i just didn't like the tie on my hair so i decided to go with um, a few of my yarn braids i took it so i'm gonna go ahead and then braid underneath and instead of the tie i'm gonna be using the wool to braid because i just do not like um the rubber band method i just don't like it that's just it okay i've tried it but twice one time and the, the way it was just um tangling my hair even though it was soaked in oils i just didn't like it so i felt like this way i can be able to separate it pretty easier than the rubber band and also i'm i plan on keeping it for like um, seven weeks so yeah so this is my Brazilian wool I have loved it I'm going to go ahead and then braid and then start with a twist so I braided like twice underneath like the yarn and I went ahead and separated the hair waited to um wool in my hair and then i went ahead to um twist the hair now guys if this video is something that you guys would like to watch please leave me a comment because i learned this from Tupo one and i think her videos are so explanatory i was planning on um uploading videos on best hair growth youtubers youtubers that you can watch that your hair will grow and also if you want to learn how to braid your hair i feel like you know we need to get the information out there's there are certain people who are just good at it and guys it is not easy at all it doesn't come on a silver platter to be able to film a tutorial just braiding your hair so those people especially Tupo who helped me to be able to braid my own hair she deserves a stand innovation so when I I twist and I get to the end of my hair I apply some castor oil as I go because I, it's gonna be in this twist for a while and I do not want to neglect the entire length of my hair. 
I'm going to be moisturizing my scalp and I'm going to show you guys the routine in a few days to come. So keep your notification bells um, and don't go anywhere. So my hair is going to be eight years in November and this is the first time I am actually, I have been able to pull this <laughs> off. No cornrows, cornrows are just a no for me. I can't just do it. So yeah, I hope this video was self-explanatory enough. I went ahead and secured the the roots of my hair with my wool just braided it and then i sort of like wrapped my brazilian wool over the end over the over the roots and then i parted into two and then i started twisting my hair i'm going to film an extensive video on that i was trying to do a box braids when i take this uh twist down but i thought to myself i need to get this twist really real how to twist my own hair with extensions so my next protective style is also going to be a twist as i want to you know be able to do well so i'm going to go ahead and then tie the ends of the hair it tends to lose a little bit after tying and i don't know why but guys if you have any tips and tricks on how to twist your hair you know just leave them in the comment section i would so much love to hear them i want to learn you know so just leave them in the comment section and i'll be so much grateful you can see the struggle guys the struggle is real i'm not gonna lie it took a lot of effort <laughs> for me to be able to pull this off so i am done and this is how it looks like the ends are secured and you know i'm going to go ahead and cut the 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 ends of it and then burn it later on so i'm going to go ahead and do the same and look at the length of my hair like if you watched in my other video i prepped my hair like this it's in the same state I have I'll just take one one braid down and then try it and fail and try it and fail. That was all that I was doing. And if you guys want to know how much this uh how many of this twists are there actually 14 twists. When I take down my hair, I maintain 14 sections so that whenever I want to braid my hair, I won't go ahead and section my hair again. I do not like to section the patterns. I just don't like it at all, guys. It's something that find it really lazy to do I find it really hard to do too so i'm maintaining the four, 14 sections and also when i take this um this braid out down this 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 hairstyle down after several weeks i'm going to still maintain the 14 um patterns and then um go on my hair throughout this year i don't plan on section but if anything should come out of like come off like i don't know maybe i might change but the 14 is like conk that is what i'm gonna be using for this whole year so guys i'm going to go ahead and take my entire braid down fluff it apply my my leave-in conditioner again apply my oils again and then secure it with my brazilian wool thread and start with a braid that's the same routine that i'm going to do i'm going to film an extensive video explaining each process when i get my hands on it really well this is just something that i wanted to show you guys that i hit myself and i'm so much proud of myself <laughs> so it's been eight years now and this is my first ever braid that i have been able to do on myself <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and spray my scalp and work it through my entire hair, coat my scalp with the oil, my hair with oil, and then I'll also go ahead and apply my vitamin E and castor oil on the entire length of my hair. So I'm going to leave you guys to watch the video when I see you at the end.
so guys I am done almost done and um, this is how I finished the braid I know that it's not the best tutorial that you can see but I just sort of sharing my journey with you guys and just you know yeah share my journey to that someone out there who just can read your hair you also want to try guys well this is me 